Thank you for coming. Yeah, of course. Yeah. What, what's going on? Why did you need to see me? It's about Lulu. Is she okay? That's the problem. I don't know. I, I don't understand. You, you called me here because there's no news? No, I called you here because Dr. Robinson has agreed to update us. I think it's about time we got some information about your sister. Agreeing to meet with us, Dr. Robinson. Of course. Yeah, we just uh, want to know what's going on with Lulu. Well, I'm happy to report that Lulu's recovery so far has been a success. Oh, my God. <laughs> She's on anti-rejection and anti-infective medications. Also, some other ones just to alleviate the side effects of some of those other drugs. That sounds like a lot, considering it was the medication that damaged her liver in the first place. We're monitoring her very closely, and she's tolerating the medication. And she's showing no signs of rejecting the liver transplant. That's important. This is great. <laughs> What's next? She should be ready to be transferred in about two weeks. That seems kind of fast. Well, once she's stabilized, she'll be more comfortable in a long-term care facility. And I understand that you aren't sending her back to Silverwater. Well, after what happened there, no. No, we actually uh, agreed on turning woods. Um, it's closer to Port Charles, and uh, we got some good reviews from friends. It's an excellent facility. Thank you for all that you and the hospital are doing for Lulu, and that includes letting Isaiah operate. Yeah, really took a village this time, didn't it? I'm just glad Lulu's operation was a success. Yes, yeah, so are we. Thank you, Portia, for everything. But what Portia said about moving Lulu. Well, you don't, you don't wanna send her back to long-term care? I don't want to send her anywhere. I want to keep her here with me. 